One of the great opportunities at St. Anselm College is study abroad courses, and this one in Belize is a, is a research course. It's a little unique compared to other ones. Students get to come out here. They get to learn what it's like to be a field biologist, looking at nature, studying nature, you know, in the midst of a nice tropical reef setting. So after the rainforest, we came out to Tobacco Key, which is a small island off the coast of Belize City, and to study marine life and the coral reefs. And it's beautiful and remote and quiet. Basically paradise in a bottle. You look up, there's palm trees and coconuts and just little dogs running around. It's just so friendly and so homey. And you feel like you could stay here forever. A typical day for our students is they come in for a lecture for maybe 10, 15 minutes. We'll go out for a snorkel, we'll do an exercise, maybe like a fish behavior exercise. Then we'll come back, we'll crunch some data, and some, one of the students may give a presentation. The school was determined as 10 or more individuals moving in unison. And they'll read these studies, they'll present them to the rest of the class, and typically the study has some, some significance to whatever it is that we're looking at for the day. And then in the afternoons, we'll do another snorkel with another exercise. Being able to learn here versus in a classroom, it's a lot more hands-on and you're actually able to see what it is you're studying firsthand versus looking just at pictures or diagrams of the different corals. And here you can actually dive down into the water and see it and study what's around it, the fish that are around it. They're learning about territoriality, defense behaviors in damselfish. They're learning about cleaning stations, um, what types of fish come and go between cleaning stations, what the purpose of them are. Uh, they're also doing coral diversity because coral reefs, one of the greatest threats is development as well as warm temperatures. All the research here has done is to be able to preserve all these really amazing habitats. So I would love to be able to preserve those. The Patch Reef off Southwater Key is also surrounded by the Barrier Reef and we did coral identification there. We've also been out to a couple farther places. We went to Whale Shoals, which was probably a 20 minute boat ride away. We also did a four reef snorkel, which is over the reef crest, which it's a lot deeper, a lot more diverse, and a lot bigger coral and fish. This was my first time snorkeling and it was one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen in my life because I didn't think that coral could be that beautiful. Different colors, different shapes. It's like an underwater museum. For this class, we have a journal that we write and it's basically a log of all the studies that we've done and all the data tables that we've taken. Biologists that are in the field have a notebook and write down all the data. We're doing the same thing and we're experiencing what they experienced. It's pretty much different than anything I've ever done in any class that I've pretty much taken my whole life. Sanius really works hard to provide students with experiential learning and in biology coming out in the field and providing this opportunity is, is quite unique because typically students when they're learning about biology are in a lab, they're in a classroom, but coming out into nature really is something that I think fits in with that experiential learning uh, goal that St. Anselm College really works towards. The thing I will remember most is watching the sunrise by myself at 5 o'clock in the morning. I'm so thankful for St. A's to give us this experience.